In this video, we'll write the Lewis structure for CrO4 2 minus. This is called the chromate ion. So first off, it's a little bit difficult because chromium here, how many valence electrons does chromium have? If you need help finding that out, there's a link in the description to a video how to find the number of valence electrons here for chromium. Turns out it has six. Oxygen, that's a little easier. That's in group 16, sometimes called 6A. That has six valence electrons as well. We have four oxygen atoms. In this two minus, that means we have two extra electrons. Electrons are negative, so we have two extra electrons here. We add all this up, we end up with 32 valence electrons for the CrO4 two minus Lewis structure. So we'll put the least electronegative element in the center. That's the chromium. And then we'll put the oxygens around it. So we have a total of 32 valence electrons for the CrO4 Lewis structure. Let's place a pair of electrons between each chromium and oxygen, and that's going to form our bond between the chromium and the oxygen atoms. We'll use eight, then we'll go around and complete the octets on the oxygens until we've used 32 valence electrons. So we've used 32 valence electrons, and each atom has an octet. So this looks like a pretty good Lewis structure. The problem is, if we calculate the formal charges for each atom, this is what we end up with. So we'd like them to add up to as close to zero as possible, or in this case, since we have an ion, to this two minus as possible. Right now, it's not quite there. What we can do is if we move a pair of electrons here to form a double bond, then our formal charges become zero for this oxygen and then plus one for the chromium. So that's better, but we can move one more pair of electrons here like this to form a double bond. And now the formal charges on these atoms here are zero, we do have the negative one here and a negative one here, but we need to have that because we have the two minus charge on the ion. So this is a better Lewis structure for CrO4 two minus, more likely or more favorable. Because we do have an ion, we need to put brackets around this and then write two minus out here. So this is the most likely or most favorable Lewis structure for CrO4 two minus, the chromate ion. This is Dr. B and thanks for watching.